Kyriakos Mitsotakis is one of Europe's most unpopular leaders. In his tenure, Athens has just added insult to Greece's injury. The economy is in complete tatters. Turkey is heckling Greece like there's no tomorrow, whereas Mitsotakis himself is drowning in a pool of scandals. If elections are to be held today, he will lose all his ground. However, time puts everything in place. Greece's ruling party is now officially trying to call the shots and leave their liberal disguise. The new democracy is set to collaborate with lovers of Russia beyond a shadow of doubt. The new partners are anti-West. Their Euroscepticism and pro-Russian nature definitely is going to create troubles for the EU, NATO and possibly even Turkey. Hi and welcome to TFI Global. I'm your host Atul Mishra. If you're watching us on YouTube, please hit the share button and press the bell icon to get all the latest updates. If you're watching us on Facebook, do like the video and subscribe to the page. You can also download our video apps. The link is in the description section. Let's begin with the video report. According to a report by Euractiv, Greece's ruling New Democracy Party is looking for an alliance with the Greek Solution, a Greek party known for its pro-Russian stance. Reportedly, Greek Minister of Domestic Affairs, Mekis Voridis, has confirmed that new democracy might walk into elections with a Greek solution. The minister stated, We don't exclude anyone. Besides the parties whose programs are completely different than ours, we can work with all parties. The next general elections are scheduled for 2023. However, demand is growing to call early elections in the wake of Mitsotaki's decaying popularity. The Watergate controversy involving the secret services of Greece monitoring opposition politicians and journalists has pushed new democracy into a difficult position. Given the fact that Mitsotaki's popularity has fallen, political analysts are predicting that a coalition government will be required in order to form a majority administration in 2023. Mitsotakis himself, though, is no great fan of Greek solutions. He has constantly turned down talks of any collaboration with the Greek solution. But it seems that his party is testing the waters. Clearly, Mitsotakis and party leaders appear to have a conflict of interest here. However, it doesn't matter for new democracy at this point because Mitsotakis is clearly losing credibility. Now, when we talk of the Greek solution, their stance on Russia could be a page turner for Greece. Greek Solution is a party that has never hidden its pro-Russian feelings. Its leader, Kyriakos Villopoulos, has openly criticized the EU's decision to send weapons to Ukraine, saying that Greece needs its last bullet. At the inception of the Ukraine war, he told the Greek parliament, in a war, you are with the defender, you are with the victim, with the crying children. Ukraine is not our friendly country, as Kiev tweeted in favor of Turkish drones and Turkish friendship. He has even backed Russia as the Ukraine war dragged on. Vilopoulos stated, Yes, Putin made Russia. It is a truth. Is he authoritarian or his country? He's a leader. We admired what he did to create Russia. We do not admire and condemn what he is doing now with Ukraine. If new democracy links its ties with the Greek solution, the whole of political scenario of Greece will change. The new government of Greece would be making a complete U-turn of all its actions in Ukraine. Mitsotakis as Prime Minister has always styled himself as a moderate and pro-US politician. However, his recent acts suggest that staunch conservatism is not far from the Hellenic Parliament. Along with that, Athens is already leaving no stone unturned to thwart Turkey. Just a few days ago, Greece was armed to teeth with Russia's S-300 defense system to take down Turkish jets wandering in Greece's airspace. Whereas just a week ago, Greece officially warned NATO to take care of Turkey or else the government won't hesitate to answer Turkey's unprovoked, unacceptable insult to Greece and the Greek people. A pro-Russia party is all set to take over Athens, though there is still time. Hence, new democracy is mulling over going into coalition with the Greek solution. However, this coalition would mark yet another staunch hardliner of the West marching towards power. NATO, the EU and Turkey would thus be forced to make a Hobson's choice over whether to ignore Greece or lock horns with it, just like 
बुडपेस्ट और रोम